Danger Dolan. From hovering UFOs to naked men in trunks to proof of the existence of angels, we count 30 weird, creepy, and downright disturbing things picked up by Google Lenses. Number 30. This bird's eye image shows the rooftop of Peabody Place Entertainment and Retail Center in Memphis, Tennessee. The creepy thing about it is someone's taken the time to spray paint come downtown and play in an area to where almost no one will see it. The invitation seems friendly enough, but I don't want to accept it. Number 29. This photo was taken in France in August 2008. It shows a strange, dark alien figure lurking on an apartment balcony. The image went viral as a creepypasta and has been hotly debated by paranormal enthusiasts. In all likelihood, it's a mannequin or some strange voodoo statue, but the weird thing about it is, upon viewing it, Google Street Team decided to blur it out, as if there was something about it that needed hiding. Number 28. This image shows a couple of military guys seemingly stopping a driver from proceeding while in the distance there's a strange black wispy thing in the sky. Are they guarding some kind of government secret? The whole thing looks like some kind of screenshot from an alien invasion movie. Number 27. These two images are before and after shots. In one image, the Google Street View car captures a healthy looking donkey just chilling on the side of the road, possibly waiting for somebody to enlist him as their noble steed. In the second image, however, the donkey sprawled out in the road looking kind of, well, dead. The public assumed that the Google car had run it over and Google rushed to clear the rumor. Apparently, the photos were taken in reverse. The donkey was first taking a nice dirt bath and sprang up when the Google car approached. So, mystery solved. No donkeys were harmed during the making of this video. Number 26. This photo, taken in January 2012, shows what looks to be a group of disembodied, possibly mummified corpses spilling out of dumpsters. But on closer inspection, you can see that they're just creepy horror movie-esque mannequins. Whew. Looked like a deleted scene from the Silent Hill movies. Number 25. In this Google Earth image, we see a strange, seemingly glowing pattern in the middle of a Chinese desert. It's either alien markings or chicken scratch from some 50-foot-tall rooster. Either way, it's not good. Not good at all. Number 24. This disturbing image depicts what looks like a couple of people dragging a body along a blood-soaked pier. The supposed crime took place at a dock in Almere, Netherlands, and the police were immediately notified. After intense scrutiny, the Reddit community determined this wasn't a crime scene at all. It was just an innocent outing with man's best friend. What appeared to be a body in a bloody trail was actually just a wet pooch that streaked some water behind him. Number 23. The Siri 2011 image shows an old man taking a stroll and somehow bending the fabric of time and space, appearing in two places at once. Fortunately, it was just an error in the Google Street View that showed him in two different points in his journey. There's no glitch in the matrix. No glitch in the matrix. Glitch in the matrix. Matrix. Number 22. Immortalized in this image is a dehydrated and possibly ill or hurt cow dragging itself. Danger Dolan. Danger Dolan. Danger Dolan. Help me. Number 22. Immortalized in this image is a dehydrated and possibly ill or hurt cow dragging itself across a two lane highway in a dilapidated area of town. This image is on the sadder side of disturbing. Hopefully she's okay. No cow crossing the road jokes that would be inappropriate. Number 21. This picture shows a giant pink bunny laying in a field somewhere in hilly North Italy. As you can see, the giant animal is bigger than a house. It's not some science experiment gone wrong, it's an elaborate art project conceived by Vienna Art Collective. The bunny is made entirely of fabric and straw, and hikers are encouraged to climb all over it as they pass on their journeys. Number 20. In this Google satellite image, we see a huge triangle in the middle of the desert in Whitman, Arizona. The triangle forms a spooky looking road with no way out. Considering that it's in the middle of nowhere, it's tempting to think that something otherworldly is going on, but it's actually just an auxiliary airfield once used by World War II pilots for landing practice. Or at least that's just what they want us to think. Number 19. This corrupt Google Street View image shows a haunting depiction of New Baltimore in New York. It looks a bit like a scary impressionistic painting or maybe a portal to hell. Apparently, the glitches are town-wide, making the whole thing look eerily reminiscent of the Silent Hill games. Half of the place appears normal while distortion is spread across other parts of the town. Number 18. This is another image that's been warped into something quite twisted by a Google Street View glitch. I'm sure you don't need this pointed out, but the woman has strange, unnatural velociraptor-like legs. I like to think she also communicates with dinosaur noises. I wonder if she's single. This is definitely one of Google's cooler glitches, and it sort of looks like a trick mirror at a carnival. Number 17. This photo was taken near Tokyo's Mataka Station in March 2013. I think you can see what's gone wrong here. The pigeons have grown human torsos! But no, seriously, what's creepy about this photo is that none of it was staged for Google. This is just eight grown adults hanging out in the street wearing pigeon heads. Number 16. In this Google Earth image, we can see a big banana. I mean, a giant sausage. I mean, a ginormous wang. 
Okay, so the image is actually just a strangely phallic building in downtown Dixon, Illinois, but come on guys, show a little maturity. Number 15. In this photo from 2012, it appeared that Google Street View had captured a gruesome homicide. In fact, the image actually made it to the news when Wilmington police asked citizens to assist in solving the mystery of who was exactly in the cab of this truck. Were they alive? As it turns out, the driver was a lifeguard and the girl in the back of the truck was actually his practice dummy. I know it's the oldest homicide excuse in the book, but this time I'm inclined to believe him. Number 14. This eerie photo of a devastating plane crash was captured at a Navy base in Almeida Point, California. Ordinarily, Google Street View blurs out the faces of people in their photos, but this horrific scene was curiously left for everyone to see. It turns out that while this is a real plane and real debris, it wasn't an actual plane crash site. The image was from the 2009 set of an NBC show called Trauma, so don't despair, it's all just make-believe. Like the moon landing. Number 13. This mysterious image shows a broken face of a statue on some desolate hillside. It's unknown how it got there or what its story is, but one thing's for certain, it's creepy as shit. Number 12. Is this an innocuous photo of seagulls on a chip runner, or is it a scene from Hitchcock's The Birds? This mass of seagulls will blot out the sky and cause chaos and destruction wherever they go. Hear that distant squawking? They're coming for you. Number 11. Another image, another would-be homicide. This 2008 photo taken in Wochester, England shows what appears to be the aftermath of a brutal murder. It seems like a nice enough neighborhood, so how did this happen? You guessed it, it didn't. The disturbing photo is actually of a 10 year old girl named Azura Bibijan who thought it'd be a cool idea to play dead in the street. I'm sure little Bibijan will grow up to be perfectly well adjusted. Number 10. This ethereal image of a Swiss mountain road seems to prove the existence of angels. It inspired a lot of religious debate online and a conclusive explanation for this heavenly illusion is yet to be offered. Number 9. In this Google Earth image, we see irrefutable proof that UFOs exist. Okay, so apparently some have gone on to prove it's just a photo of an oddly shaped building shot from above, but still, this offers irrefutable proof that buildings exist. Number 8. There are no glitches or trickery in this image. These are the ruins of Ashima, a Japanese island that's been uninhabited for 40 years. It was formerly a thriving mining town, but it was abandoned in the 1970s. Now it's deemed unsafe for tourists to visit, leaving it relatively alone looking ghostly. Hashima was, however, used as a villain's headquarters in Skyfall. Number 7. This street view image simply defies explanation. Here we see a naked man in the boot of his car reaching for some juice, lying in the driveway is a partially formed, possibly dead, possibly sleeping dog, and if you look in the left corner you got what sort of looks like a body bag. Sheer unadulterated madness. Number 6. This image is a whole nother breed of disturbing. It shows an abandoned baby crawling along outside of a Gucci store. Either this kid's a super fan of high-end fashion or this is just an example of shitty parenting. Number 5. This image shows a pack of terrifying, possibly rifle-toting highway banditos. It's possible this is just an innocent prank and not some twisted example of gang warfare, but it's still pretty freaky. I think I'd feel safer joining the pigeon gang from earlier. Number 4. This Street View image comes courtesy of Canadian artist John Rathman, who follows Street View to capture screenshots for his own online gallery. In this shot, you can see two toddlers holding up a man with what are hopefully a pair of fake guns. Innocent play or shitty parenting? You be the judge. Number 3. This disturbing bunch of disturbingness shows what appears to be two strange twins staring directly at the camera while holding gun-like objects in their left hands. But at closer glance, it seems that twinification is due to another one of Google's infamous camera glitches. At least I know what to get Google for Christmas now. A functional camera. Number 2. In this 2008 Google Street View image, it appears someone's trying to escape from their Pittsburgh home via window. As you can see, they've tied a bunch of sheets together like they're reenacting a prison movie. What are they so desperate to escape from? Pretty creepy. Number 1. Finally, we have another unsettling Street View image that faintly resembles a still from The Walking Dead. Here we see a field of lots of creepy people standing around. On closer inspection, it's actually just a bunch of creepy scarecrows standing around. The scarecrows only come to life at midnight during a full moon, so really there's no glitch in the matrix. Never go